Hello friends, welcome to my channel. In this video, we are going to discuss about the index of Dow Jones Industrial Average. Now, I generally don't cover index until and unless it's very important. And the reason why I am doing it right now is because of this. So this is the daily chart or more specifically because of uh, the monthly chart. Okay. So if you haven't figured it out, let me show it to you. Now just take a two or three second pause and uh, let's see what you can observe. Uh, rest then I will tell you. Now if you have figured it out then fine. Otherwise I will show it to you. So this is the RSI which is not clearly visible I think. Now if you are looking at the RSI you will see a negative divergence over here. Right? This is the first thing and why I am showing it is very important and more specifically when these things happens on a monthly basis because monthly trend won't change very easily this is the longest chart if there is a change on monthly basis then you should be uh, very much aware about it and you should be at least skeptical about the move going forward now this is one more uh, indicator this is one more indicator which is showing that this is the first month where you have this uh, red bar of our, this is uh, awesome oscillator and this is the first month on the monthly chart where, where you can see a clear uh, selling with a big red bar uh, that has formed over here now <clears throat> as far as the chart is concerned if i may show it to you then you will see the first red candle and uh, it has already covered the previous month's candle okay so that's the first thing on the monthly chart now on the weekly chart as you can see uh, this green line is the 20 day moving average simple moving average now the red candle crossed below its 20 day moving average so the next logical target we are having here as per the weekly chart is uh, 32,300 right this 50 day moving average so this is the next logical support we have here right now let's go to the monthly char daily chart where we are going to do the uh, trend analysis and uh, it has broken you know all three important moving averages uh, you it has broken 20 then 50 then 100 and the next logical support you will find here uh, will be at uh, 200 day moving average simple moving average which is the golden moving average as well and it's it says 33044 so this is the level which we are going to look at as far as the daily chart is concerned uh, one more point i forgot because if you are observing the uh, monthly chart then you can see your 20 day moving average at 29,700 so the range varies a wide range is available in front of you from 29,700 till 33,000 so I think this is a very big uh, a trend or very big level because uh, this is around 3,000 to 4,000 plus points so we can't go with this big range but uh, at least if we combine uh, on our if you observe daily as well as weekly chart you will see that somewhere in between 32 and 33,000 uh, there is a next probable support but let's analyze the daily chart and let's see what's going over here and uh, so this is the daily chart and as you can see this is the resistance level that the index has formed Dow Jones has formed and if I apply this to find out my support level it will give me the 200 day moving average okay it will give me somewhere near 200 day moving average which we 
can at least think that the next probable support here at 33,668, which is, uh, I think, uh, 1600 points away. <laughs> So 15 or 1600 points away. So be very much skeptical about how this price chart is moving and how the indices are moving. Now, when we have first uh, the daily charts get impacted, then after a couple of months, the weekly chart and things happened on monthly chart very slowly. But uh, when things happen, because uh, not only Dow Jones, the entire uh, major indices of US stock market has been rolling down for the past one week and it creates a lot of damage okay and over a period of time things get flattened out and you can see the impact on the monthly chart so at least we have our next support 1500 points below the current level that is the first thing second thing as I told you the range varies from daily monthly and weekly chart so we have 29,700 as well we have 32,000 as well and the least we are expecting over here is 33,000 so we have to see how this is going to pan out and you know do not jump in with uh, all the blazing uh, trades you have uh, for the sake of uh, you know some profit which may or may not happen on the upside for the time being okay so here's your position if you don't understand do not uh, have any position at least you can observe the market or uh, you know take decisions accordingly if you are uh, professional then you don't seek my advice or any suggestions but still uh, this is just an observation about the trend and hope this will benefit or at least save some of your losses going forward so this is the end of the video thanks for watching